Hi, my name is Jonathan Lee, and I'm the Director of Design and Development for Washburn Guitars. And I'm here with the guys from Guitar Player Magazine at the 2008 Winter NAMM Show in Anaheim, California. It's really sunny and warm here, so I feel for all of you guys that are, you know, negative 20 right now. Wish you were here. So I'm here to talk about some of our new products here at Washburn. Washburn being 135 years old this year, one of the original American uh, branch based in Chicago. And what I want to talk about is the RSD-135. That's short for Revival Solo Dreadnought. The 135 represents a limited edition of 135 Made in America guitars. Um, this guitar here draws its legacy and fatherhood from this guitar over here. And this guitar that we're looking here on the right is a legitimate Washburn 5244 built in 1937 that we were able to purchase and put in our library. We know of three guitars in the world that still exist that are this model. So you can see very clearly that they share the body shape. They share uh, cosmetic details like the smile bridge, the understated fingerboard inlay, the headstock. But if you think about what was going on in 1937, they were screwing down the bridges. We don't really do that now. So it's a little bit wider. You can see back in the 30s, big, big pick guards. We felt in today's world, we want to speak to that, but create a little bit more elegance, as well as using the micro dots. It's got GraphTech ratio tuners. And if you, if you don't know about these, they're cool. If you look at the gears and the teeth on each one of these uh, tuners, there's a different number of teeth. And why do you do that? It's because a half turn on any string is a half step of pitch. A full turn on any string is a full pitch. And so if you're not used to that and you get used to that, it's hard to go back. They're really, really cool. This guitar here has a very thick V-shaped neck. It's what they were building back in the late 30s. This is really optimized for today's player with a neutral C, one and three quarters here, bow nut and saddle. It's very, very comfortable to play. Again, made in America by the Washburn Custom Shop, the RSD-135, and actually another cool thing, in enclosure, so we're gonna build 135 of them. The first serial number, which we have here, is 1883, followed by 1884. The final one is gonna be 2018. So actually, a number of people that have been buying and ordering these guitars have selected specific serial numbers, like when you're born. So anyways, 135 years, based in Chicago, Washburn Guitars. I'm Jonathan Lee, washburnguitars.com. Thank you.